how to forward your GoDaddy business email to Gmail. Please mentally raise your hand if you have one personal email. One email for your business. One junk email because don't we all have one of those? And two random emails for companies you thought about starting. We can't see you. But we're pretty sure most of you reading this right now can relate. Because we at Seahawk are dedicated to making your business life better. We're here to tell you an eye-opening little hack that will have you singing the hallelujah chorus. Kiss all that wasted time scouring the depths of your brain for multiple passwords goodbye because today, we're teaching you how to forward your GoDaddy business email to Gmail. Shall we? How to set up GoDaddy email to Gmail. Step 1. Log in. The first step is to log into your GoDaddy account. After you sign in, go to My Products. Step 2. Forward your email. To create your email forward, scroll down the page until you see the additional products tab. Click the blue drop-down arrow and choose Email Forwarding. Unless you've already used it, you should see several free credits depending on how many domains you have. Click the Redeem button and a pop-up will appear on screen. If you have multiple domains, click the drop-down arrow, choose the domain that corresponds to the business email you want to forward and hit Redeem Credit. Click Create Forward and enter the business email you want to create in the first field option. Enter the email address you want your business emails to forward to in the second field option. Then click the Create button at the bottom of the pop-up screen. Step 3. Correct your DNS settings. You must correct a series of tasks to forward your GoDaddy business email to Gmail. Click the drop-down arrow on the Tools tab and choose Server Settings. There should be an error message that reads no mix records were found meaning your email forwarding will not work as it is. To combat this, you must go to your DNS settings page and enter the correct information. To access your DNS settings page, log into whatever hosting platform you have. If your website is hosted through GoDaddy, open a new tab and go to your GoDaddy profile account. Click My Products. Under the Domain section, you will see your domain address. Click the DNS button to the right of your domain name. To add your mix records, Scroll to the bottom of the records section and click Add. Fill in the type field with the mix option. In the host field, type at the rate. To fill in the points to box, go to your other tab and copy the first line under the correct settings box and paste it into the points to box. Type a zero in the priority box and click Save. You'll be taken back to the record section. Choose Add again to create your second mix record. Choose Mix as your type. Add or at the rate to the host box. To fill in the points to box, go to your other tab and copy the second line under the correct settings box and paste it into the points to box. In the priority box, type the number 10 and click save. Go back to your previous tab where the mix records error message was found and refresh the screen. You should get the green light and a message saying, your mix records are correct. This means your email forwarding is good to go. However, two more steps cover all your business email forwarding bases. To test it out, you can send an email to your business email and see if it appears in your Gmail account. Step 4. Create a third-party email account. While you can successfully forward business emails to your Gmail account, you can't send emails from your business email account. We're going to use SMTP to GeoService here. Here are some more alternatives for best free email marketing services. Send in blue www.sendinblue.com closing bracket. Mailkimp mailkimp.com closing bracket. Mailerlite www.mailerlite.com closing bracket. Benchmark www.benchmarkamal.com closing bracket. Omnisend www.omnisend.com closing bracket. Sender www.sender.net closing bracket. Create an account from any of the email service. After you sign up, you will have your SMTP username and password. Step 5. Add your SMTP account to Gmail. Go to your Gmail account. Click the gear icon on the far right side of the screen and choose settings. Click the accounts and import tab. Under the send mail as option, Click add another email address. Fill in the name box with the from name you want customers to see when replying to your business emails. In the email address box, add the business email address you created and click next step. The next screen will ask for your SMTP info. Copy and paste your SMTP to geo username as well as the password. In the SMTP server box, go back to your SMTP to geo account page and click finish. Copy the info next to the SMTP server and paste it into the SMTP server box. 
In the port drop-down, choose 25 and then click Add Account. A pop-up will appear on the screening saying you should receive a confirmation email in your Gmail inbox. Click the email and copy the confirmation code. Go back to the pop-up, paste the code into the verification box, and hit verify. And we're done. To triple check if you correctly forwarded your GoDaddy business email to Gmail, go to your Gmail account and return to your settings. Click the Accounts and Import tab and scroll down to the Send Mail as option. You will get your business email account listed. We hope this comes in handy in your day-to-day -day business life. Check out Seahawk services for anything related to WordPress.